Okay. I have not heard these questions, by the way. Okay, right. So, Zaina and I are back for another episode of mm -hmm. The Shout. Um, we thank you for sending in your last questions. Uh, yep. Well, the last video of sending your questions. Um, got some good feedback, some good comments. But this one um, is, is going to be an interesting one. And this is from a female um, viewer. Um, she sent me a question. I get lots of questions. Like, I'm not even just chatting about this. Like, I genuinely get <laughs> lots of questions. But some of them, like, are, are from, like, June. Like, you know what I mean? So some of these I'm, like, digging up. And this one says, I have a dilemma. I'm really into this guy, but I'm starting to think that he only wants me for one thing. Exclamation mark. How do I go, in, how do I go about bringing up this conversation with him? Now, obviously, the conversation is... Yo, like, where's this going? 100%. Just be upfront. Just be upfront. Go on, say it upfront. Just be upfront. Know what you want. If you're happy. In this <laughs> <laughs> if you're happy to, to, you know, just have that one thing relationship with this person, then that's fine. But if you want more, then you've got to let your feelings be known. And don't settle because he, men, he won't change. Okay, if this is what he wants, this is what he wants. He won't change. You can't force someone to change. As in, like, he you won't can't. Change. No, I'm not saying he won't, but you can't. He didn't. Yeah, but like, you can't force someone to change. Right now, he's in the mentality okay. that he just wants okay. one thing. Okay. And if you force someone to change, it's not going to be meaningful. You should want someone who wants more with you. You can't be like, oh no, I want more or this and that. Because then it's, you know, it's, I would say the same thing to, 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 to a guy if a girl's saying that to him. Do you know what I mean? You can't force people to change what they want right now. They might change eventually, sure, but you can't force someone to change it. So I would say, let your think about what you want. If what you want matches what he wants, then fine. If it doesn't, which I'm pretty sure it doesn't, you know, because that's what she's messaged in for, mm -hmm. then just make what you want known. And if that's not the reaction you want, I don't think that's a good idea. Go. I don't think that's a good idea. I think you need to just allow it. And leave what? it. Leave it. Oh yeah. Like real talk here. Like, Why like, not let it be known? No, because I mean you can like and then see if something's in my eyes. Sorry. Um, you can see if um, they're actively going to do anything about it, which is obviously you got to give people the benefit of the mm -hmm. doubt. But I think more than like once you cro once you've got into that territory, then it's to the point where if he feels like he can like treat her in the way that she's being treated, because obviously it's a way where it's like he's probably only seeing her at certain hours. You know what I mean? Doesn't really want to yeah. go out. You know what I mean? Just, you know, wants to just do his thing. So, it's now trying to flip the narrative. It's like, Zayna's right. Like, he's not, I think maybe in this circumstances, he's kind of got a bit too far where he might just be like, you know what? You're changing the terms of, of, of the agreement mm. now. I'm not on it. I don't want to go to the cinema. Mm. I don't want to go to the park. I don't want to, I want to come around at 11 o'clock and do my thing. But then that's I mean? kind of sad because you've let it go on for this long. Right. I always say to my friends, yeah, mm. don't do house visits until it's something serious. And I mean it. We don't do house visits. It's not a house call thing. <laughs> it's not. It's not. House call visit because thing. then you get taken for a mug. There's a saying, yeah? You do. And I'm sorry. I really <clears throat> am sorry. And for real. But you have to, like, if that's not what you want, then don't don't allow it to happen in the first place. And I know that's hard. And and, and I do get that. That, you know, it's hard and, 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 you know, feelings get in the way. I do completely understand that. But at some point, you just have to say enough is enough. Right. Don't let it go, get, go on for so long. Because then you're going to get hurt. And you shouldn't get hurt over someone like that. Thank you. I mean, that's a bit... Anyway, there is a saying, yeah? that women want time without having to give up sex and men want sex without having to give up time mm -hmm. so you have to really when it comes to like giving up something because obviously the one thing is sex mm -hmm. when it comes to giving that away mm -hmm. you have to decide whether the time frame in which you give it away matches up with your expectations mm -hmm. so if you if you're there giving it up after three weeks Two dates, one date. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm waiting for <laughs> you to land. <laughs> I'm waiting for you to land. If you're not giving up quick, then... And I think that's your... I'm not saying that, oh, there's anything wrong with that. Let, let me preface my statements. I don't want you to say, like, oh, well, then you deserve to be treated that way. That's not what I'm saying. No. But general, like... Conven sorry, conventional wisdom will say 
is that if you're giving up really quick, then the chances of you getting anything serious out of that person is very small. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? It's <laughs> yeah. very small. So you have to that. so you have to understand like what it is In you some want. Situations, it's got to marry up. It's got to marry yeah. up. Yeah. I to a certain extent I agree with that because I know people who have, you know, that quite quickly. Um, but they're still in, in some have even got married. Do you know what I mean? So I think in some situations... There are, there are aberrations. There, yeah, of course. Um, but... People... I don't want to generalise and say men. Because I know there's females. But I'm just going to say men just yeah, for the sake of it. Of yeah. But men are very good at sweet talking. And trying to get what they so, want. So, hang on a minute. Trying Whoa. to get what they want. <laughs> And, 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 oh and, and, and I'm not saying that the females don't do that. I'm not saying that females aren't to blame for, for, for letting that, you know. But so sometimes, then, but, but, obviously, whoever's sent in the question has <laughs> <laughs> put a victim <laughs> to the man's words. <laughs> I'm not trying to say that she's not at fault here, but I'm just trying to say, like, it's something, like, when you have feelings for someone or when you're like interested in someone, sometimes it's That's hard fine. to kind of like But then you have to manage that with the expectations. Yeah, though, yeah, not. but it's sometimes it's hard. But then but okay, I understand that, but what I'm saying is That's why you don't do house visits where you know Okay, so then you're we're, we're kinda of saying the same thing in, in essence, because I'm saying, well listen, like yeah, you've you you have said that there's some people who have done it quickly and they've stated uh, for some people that works, but I just yeah. think just in just you know, if that's something that it's gonna bother you if 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 you if the guy only wanting you for that is gonna bother you, then you have to treat that very delicately. Mm -hmm. If that is gonna bother you, because for some people, for some women, it doesn't matter, and that's fine. I'm not trying to say again. I'm not trying to shame anyone like mm -hmm. for who's giving off the things quick. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying that like, all right, if that happens, if you've given it off thing and then you kind of let that, you've shown that card, then you just it's kind of hard to then try to flip the narrative and say, oh, actually, like okay. the first three times we met up, we've had sex, and then now you want to start going. Bowling and now you want to start going thing. Well, no, nah, it doesn't work like that. You, you so how long? Kind of flip it. So how long would you would you um, oh wait for god. it? Oh my god! What do you mean? How long would I wait? Why don't we make this person? Because like, everyone knows how long I would wait. So how long would you wait? <laughs> I mean, if I'm no, okay, but like, okay, what's, right. what's, really what's a respectable time to wait then? I don't. I don't think it's, it depends on you. Mm -hmm. So it's like, if a respectable time for you is three hours, then it's three hours. If a respectable time for you is three months, then it's three months. Like, if I'm really into the girl and I'm actually interested in getting to know the girl, sorry, the woman, yeah, then I will wait, however, however, like, and it's not, I'm not waiting to do that. I'm waiting because I'm interested. Maybe what I if she says, like, coming. two years, a year? Then I'm out. What's, no, no, I'm not trying to do that. <laughs> but you just I'm said, sorry. you no. would wait if you no, were no, really no, no, interested I'm not, in the girl. No, 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 I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm, I'll contradict myself. But <laughs> I'm saying there's, there's, there's... But why can't, what if she says reasonable... I'm waiting for marriage? Then I'm not the one. <laughs> no, but that's honest though. That's, have you seen that episode of Fresh Prince when Will pretends to marry when Will gets married to a girl just so he can do his thing? Do you get me? He caught he caught hell for that. I'm just saying yeah. I'm not. I would never. If 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 a woman said, "Listen, I'm waiting for marriage," blah blah. If I was like head over heels sprung, can't like like something yeah. spiritual yeah. hit me, <laughs> then maybe. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But. Like, in terms of just, like, I feel, I don't know, I, I would have to be on that same wavelength. Like, not to say that it's not impossible. I'm not shunning anyone. Again, I'm not looking down at anyone who would do that. If that if you have that kind of internal strength, then fair enough. But me personally, I, I, I mean, I can't. No, it's just, I, and I'll be honest, I'll have that conversation. I wouldn't leave anyone on. Yeah, well, that's good, so, but 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 some guys won't do that. Yeah, that, that's 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 I scummy. That's mad scummy. Yeah, that's mad scummy. That's mad scummy. I just think I think in that situation, going back to the question, mm. if you feel that having a conversation would could potentially help the situation, yeah, go for the conversation. If you feel <laughs> <laughs> like it's too little, too late, um, then just walk away. But actually, no. Just let your feelings be known. Yeah, yeah okay. Let your feelings yeah, be known. Yeah. Say what it is, and just accept. If he says, "Look, that's not what I'm. In that's not what I, what I want. What I'm interested in," then you're just gonna have to take the L and go. Yeah, I, that's what I'm saying. I feel like, yeah, you're right. Like maybe not just walking away. Is yeah. The answer. I'm just saying that from a perspective of a man. Like if I was in that predicament where a girl and I had that kind of relationship, and then all of a sudden it was boom, bang, bang. Then maybe. You know, I, I haven't made my intentions clear enough because I thought maybe 
us doing that so early means that all seriousness has gone out of the way. Maybe that's just my expectation. Mm. And her expectations don't marry up. And but yeah, or maybe people do things differently. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Really so, you, yeah. you know, maybe that's just something that I would have to kind of do differently. But I think in general, like, it's just very difficult to switch that narrative around. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Like, from a male's perspective, it's like, oh, what, now you want to start? What do mm. you mean? Like, you, you've done it backwards. Yeah. Some guys will go, all right, fair enough. Like, but for me, it's like, well... And really, the question has got to be, why has it become so taboo in that way? Where you, some people just like to have sex. Yeah. And, like, to them... It's like, all right, I want to do that because I enjoy it. And, and, and it doesn't mean I'm a hoe. No, mean I'm a, no. Do you know what I mean? And that's fine, but make it known. Make it known. Yeah. At the beginning, be like, look, I just want sex. Or look, I, I want more. Yeah, make yeah, it known. Yeah, from the jump. Don't waste people's time. Like, both sexes. Don't waste each other's time. Yeah. Just make it known what you want. Because that way you can avoid situations like this where some people, you know, might be getting hurt. That sweet talking thing was hilarious, though. Because <laughs> it's like... The amount of times, man, like, yeah, but he was so convinced. No. Like, you obviously, all right, fair enough, he might have tapped into something, like a different, you know, that kind of energy. But at yeah. the end of the day, like, if that's important to you and the most important thing is, is holding on to that for as long as possible, then, do you know what I mean? You've got to You, you gotta just got to know what you want at the end of the day and just make it known. That, that's the most important thing. Know what you want, make it known. Boom. And if people fit into that narrative, then that's cool. If they don't subscribe to that narrative... <laughs> Then, you know, yeah. goodbye. Be on your merry way. Um, yeah, I think... I, yeah. Let us know what you think. Yeah, yeah like, yeah, what's thing? And also as well, for this particular uh, viewer, as far as that's concerned, yeah, all right, have the conversation, but don't expect a massive turnaround. It's, yeah. it's good that, obviously, like you've acknowledged that there is more that you want and you're willing to do something about it, but maybe with this one... You might have to just hold the L as, as, as I So, um, yeah, what do you guys think? Um, have you ever been in this predicament? Do you know anyone in this predicament? Um, let us know in the comments mm -hmm. below. Um, we're going to be back in the studio soon, the Blue Chairs. So, um, look out <laughs> for that. <laughs> yeah, look out for that. Geneva and Dwayne will return. And, um, yeah, man, just follow us, subscribe, mm -hmm. like, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.